Good morning, everyone. Uh, welcome to the slightly delayed briefing for Thursday, the 30th of November. Okay, taking a look at the chart, um, midday it's showing this occlusion just slightly to our south, um, which bring with it quite a lot of rain. Uh, we, we're just on the edge of it, but um, even being clear of it, I think is very moist, uh, damp air mass, which is not going to be very good for us. Uh, going ahead to tomorrow, uh, looking a little bit better. Um, no activity over the top of us, less of ours, a bit further apart. So uh, provided it does dry out a little bit, it should be better. And going into the weekend, similar picture. Um, looks like there may be some unsettled weather around with these trough lines dotted about. Um, but otherwise not looking too bad. Uh, winds today, pretty much from the east, uh, quite strong at flying height, 25 to 30 knots. And the current sat pick, you, you can see roughly that occlusion um, underneath us. It looks like there are some showers up to the northeast as well, um, but generally a lot of cloud uh, around with no real clearance in sight. Rain radar shows us just to be on the edge of this band here, um, and the majority of it down to the southwest at the moment. Showers up to the northeast as well. And forecast as we go throughout the day. We just seem to stay on the edge of it. Um, as we go to the afternoon, it is sort of clear of us, uh, but we're still very near it, and it's probably still going to be foggy and all day. Public forecast showing cloud all day, not picking up fog, interestingly. Um, breeze from the northeast and medium visibility is actually showing good visibility uh, later on, but humidity rather high. Uh, is a little bit lower into the afternoon. Um, top temperature day, three or maybe four degrees. Dew points at about minus one, so it is very cold now. And that's a view outside. Currently minus 1.5 degrees. Dew points at minus three. Um, that's... Odium's last uh, overcast at 200 feet and mist. It sounds like what we've got here. Forecast, not overly optimistic. Um, they're, they're showing for the day broken clouds of 400 and mist. Uh, they're showing becoming few a thousand, which is about 800 here. Uh, they put a prop 30 for this morning for a lower cloud and uh, they put a prop 30 for this afternoon scattered clouds at 1400. That's a little bit of optimism. Um, Farnborough, very similar, broken clouds at 100 and mist. Um, and no real optimism in their forecast. Uh, they're showing few clouds at a thousand, which is still a little bit low. Otherwise, broken 400 are missed. Okay, top meteo, this is 9 a.m. We go ahead a couple of hours um, to midday. It's actually showing less fog and slightly higher cloud. Um, interestingly, as we go into the afternoon, it's showing it to be clear. Um, so quite if you listen to this forecast, it might be flyable later. Um, interestingly, Top Meteo has actually got it right for the last few days, uh, where the other forecasts have got it wrong, so maybe it will be flyable. Um, no no terms today. Okay, if we did go flying, it would be 0 9. Uh, we have the launch point slightly offset to the south here, and winch launching from the north side of the runway with the cables running down the edge like there. Um, and aerodyne will be from the south side of the runway. Uh, there's no movements. And if you do go flying, obviously be very careful of misting canopies. Um, probably quite a big risk. It, I expect if we do go, it'll probably be quite low cloud base still, so probably very damp. Um, so be watching out for that. Okay. Um, small chance of flying this afternoon, but more likely not. Um, but hopefully I'll see you out there. Bye for now.